Ted Lasso might be the hottest show on TV. But while fans wait to see what will happen in season three, the cast is keeping very busy with a slew of other projects, including Jeremy Swift, who plays Higgins, who's here with me now. Now let's talk about your music, man. You obviously play double bass in the show. What I'm curious about, because you do that in real life, was do they write that in for you? Did you go, hey, guys, I'm going to play this character, but check this out. Oh, no, it was um, <clears throat> it was a conversation uh, with Jason in the car park at the studio where... I said, what happens when uh, Higgins comes back after his resignation? I think I said, how long has he been away? Because, you know, does he have a really long beard? You know, and I said, maybe he could have a Rasputin length beard, you know. <laughs> and he said, hey, maybe more like a jazz beard. And I said, oh, well, that's really interesting, Jason, because I play jazz. <laughs> and, um, and so that's how that came about. And then he said, like in an amateur way, and I said, no, I think I'm all right. I do find, see, I'm a drummer. I, I love music as well. Mm -hmm. I feel like everything's rhythmic, right? Like so much of the show, there's a rhythm to the fun, the comedy, the, the moments. Do you find that as an actor, it kind of goes fluidly between both art forms, do you think? Absolutely, yeah. And particularly with comedy, there, of course, there is, there is pause, rhythm, delivery, um, all that kind of stuff. It all joins together. I, I totally agree. Now, obviously, we're all waiting for season three. Let's talk about your new music. You have a new song, Wonderland, out, right? Yeah, this new song, Wonderland, I've been working on for quite a bit. It started off, it was just a rhythm track for a long time. It sounded sort of like a grime track or something, but I thought I'm not like a, an East London um, grime artist, <laughs> like Stormzy, and I, I probably couldn't afford to get Stormzy on it. <laughs> um, you know, um, maybe it'll have to go in a different direction, but it just, um, you know, I ended up adding some sort of uh, gospel sort of vocals and then, and then synths and uh, went in a different direction. Um, I did release an album about five years ago. Um, and my profile wasn't quite what it is now. I mean, I just have to sort of get it out there, you know, and and hopefully people will listen to it because uh, otherwise it's slightly indulgent. Um, but, you know, I think it's good enough for people to sort of get into. I have to ask about season three real quick. Uh, what, what can we expect for Higgins coming up? Um, more, um, and well, he's certainly he's more empowered, you know, as he was in season two. He's he's can make decisions and affect the, you know, the run and the course of the club's success, and uh, and more strange noises from his throat, and um, yes, um, hopefully a bit more whimsical comedy. <laughs> I love it. And is it true? It is true. Your wife plays your wife on the show, right? On, on Ted Lasso? She she does, yes, that's right. So yeah. I've I've tried to work with my wife here and there. How did you perfect that? You guys are great together there. Do you go home and is it different? <laughs> you were terrible in that scene. Why did you do yeah. um, I did know? You wrote it. <laughs> We had worked together, you know, we met on a theatre show a thousand years ago, um, and we've done a couple of little, like we did a film and a TV together. Um, but, yeah, this was, um, well, it was just very easy. It's a, it's a very relaxed uh, sort of happy relationship. Um, and I have to say that when we did the last season, of the, the Christmas app, it was sort of like just being, you know, you know, we were, we were sort of like chopping up carrots and things. And I thought, this is just like being at home only with a camera crew and, you know, 20 other people. In the room. <laughs> yeah, I just thought, wow, we could do this every day. Um, yeah, it was really enjoyable. Sure. Well, it comes out, it's natural. It's a dream job and you get to be so real, I guess, with each other on set and off, which is a, a great thing to watch. Check out Wonderland October 14th and the full album will be released February 3rd. Thanks, Jeremy. All right. Thank you, man.